Hey guys. So, um, I wanted to expand a little bit more on John 5 and 14. And it reads, Afterward, Jesus finded him in the temple and said unto him, Behold, thou art made whole. Sin no more, lest a worse thing come unto thee. All I'm saying is, stop playing with God. Stop telling lies. Stop fornicating. Stop um, committing adultery. Stop stealing. Stop gossiping. Being conniving. Backstabbing. Stop being covetous and jealous hearted and envious of other people. Stop doing those things. All of those things are counterproductive. They're also works of the flesh. And the end is destruction. So stop doing it. And then you have some of these people, you know, uh, they they like, well, I just been blessed. You know, ain't nothing. God ain't doing nothing to me. I'm, I'm living right. I'm doing what's right. Yeah, in the daytime, and soon as nightfall, you at the club. Child bye. I don't know about y'all. I don't, I don't even want to think about what the worst thing could have been. Okay? So my advice to you is to stop doing it. Stop, stop sinning. Stop doing those things that you know is wrong. Keep thinking that God going to keep giving you... Uh, a hundred and ten more chances, you know. Just stop it. Lest the worst thing come upon you. God have been faithful to us. He delivered us in our time of need. He helped us and protected us when we couldn't even do it for ourselves. So, all I'm saying is, go and sin no more. Lest the worst thing come upon you. I also want to say this, y'all, before I end this video. Be careful at the company you keep. Be careful what you reveal about yourself to people. Be careful of these people always uh, complimenting you to death. Okay? Be careful. That's all I'm saying. Be wise. Be led by the Spirit. You know, uh, that, uh, that's all I can tell you. Because people can be very deceitful and very covert. You know, I've, I've had people in my life, y'all, they, they will give you the shirt off their back and stab you in yours all in the same breath. I'm just telling you. Be careful and be mindful of who are around you. And uh, like I said in one of my other videos, move in silence. I know sometimes, y'all, and I've experienced this before too. Sometimes, you know, when good stuff happens to you, good things, you know, or you've accomplished something, you know, sometimes you want to share, you know, what God is doing in your life. You know, the blessings, you know. And it's not to brag or boast, but you're excited and you just want to share with somebody hoping that they'll feel the same way, you know, and, and celebrate with you, you know. But y'all, I'm just telling you, from personal experience, sometimes you just have to celebrate and party, <laughs> celebrate your accomplishments by yourself, okay? I'm just telling you, y'all. You have to be careful and mindful of the company you keep. This is a new year, and I keep saying that it's a new year, but and it's time to start thinking different and, and doing different things. Like, do not stay caught up in doing uh, the same old thing, the same old way, and, and instead of expecting a different result, you know. And there's some people in y'all life, y'all know. Y'all know who they are. Y'all should have been letting them folks go. Been let them go. Stop letting people uh, attach themselves to you 
and they don't mean you no good just trying to uh bleed you bone dry you know trying to uh pretty much uh a uh, uh, ride your coattail you know stuff like that man listen ain't nobody got time for that i'm just being real with you ain't nobody got time for that 